नमस्कार प्रेजेंटिंग बिफोर यू दर्सडे वेडनेसडे हेप्टोमेटल हेडलाइंस एंड ऑल्सो मेजर हाईलाइट्स फ्रॉम एनवायरमेंटेशन पब्लिश ऑन नाइन्थ नवम्बर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू दिस वॉज इश्यू नंबर फोर्टी एट फॉर द यूनियन मिनिस्टर ऑफ जल शक्ति गजेंद्र सिंह शेखावत ऑन वेडनेसडे रिलीज द डायनेमिक ग्राउंड वाटर रिसोर्स असेसमेंट रिपोर्ट फॉर इंटायर कंट्री फॉर द ईयर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू एज पर द ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू असेसमेंट रिपोर्ट द टोटल एनुअल ग्राउंड वाटर रिचार्ज फॉर द एंटायर कंट्री इज फोर थर्टी सेवन पॉइंट सिक्स बिलियन क्यूबिक मीटर्स एंड एनुअल ग्राउंड वाटर एक्सट्रैक्शन फॉर द एंटायर कंट्री स्टू डेट टू थर्टी नाइन Further, out of the total seven zero eight nine assessment units in the country, one zero zero six units have been categorized as overexploited. In the report, about four percent of the assessment units have been categorized as critical, fifteen percent semi-critical, and sixty-four percent as safe. Editorial opinion deliberates on impressive coverage of Jal Jeevan Mission. and a need to monitor allied issues like water supply timing wastage of water due to no flow control and quality check etc another editorial opinion will india pay compensation shares some critical views on indian governance in guest column dk singhal an erudite engineer from roorkee a certified energy auditor and a prolific environmental columnist writes plastic industry's biggest damage to the environment the issue also covers some happenings at cop 27 sharm el sheikh egypt union environment minister bupendra yadav inaugurates india pavilion the minister also addressed a gathering at the event of launching Mangrove Alliance for Climate at the COP27. The Conference of Parties COP27 started on 6th November and will continue till 18th. 2022 Global Status Report for Buildings and Construction reveals all-time high carbon dioxide emissions. National Green Tribunal sets out mandates for a clean green India. Green Court verdicts are impactful, instrumental, and enabling government of India to push forward Swachh Bharat Urban and Gramin Mission, as well as Amrut schemes. As you know, Environment Notations is India's first environmental weekly newspaper. Please support this channel. You can support us by making payments through the UPI QR code displayed on the screen. Expert Appraisal Committee for Industry Sector One Projects recommended grant of environmental clearance to the proposed expansion of the existing steel plant by AIC Iron Industries Private Limited, located at Benipur, Purulia District. West Bengal other projects recommended by the EAC are expansion proposal of Sri Metallics Limited to increase iron ore pelletization plant from 0.6 mtpa to 1.2 mtpa and 1.0 mtpa iron beneficiation plant located at village Anra in Keonjer district of Odisha expansion proposal by J Balaji Industries Limited located in Mangalpur Industrial Complex Bakhtar Nagar in Pashchim Bardwan district of West Bengal expansion proposal of Chaman Metallics Limited located in MIDC Tadali Chandrapur Maharashtra Arshilar Mittal Nippon Steel India's proposal for change of fuel from LSHS to natural gas Fuel oil is standby in the existing 7.0 mtpa iron ore pelletization plant at Kanchara Palam Village in Visakhapatnam, Andhra Pradesh. Proposal of Otta Thingol India Private Limited seeking environmental clearance for their proposed standalone cement grinding unit was deferred due to its distance from the boundary of Gangai Kondan Spotted Deer Sanctuary. 
Hearing on the application of Wusun Power and Steel Limited for reconsideration of EC to its proposal for change in EC configuration from 5.5 MTPA to 4.5 MTPA in the project located at Telkoloi Village in Rengali Tehsil, Sambalpur District of Orissa, the expert committee concluded that the reply submitted by the company is not adequate or satisfactory. While reviewing the compliance report stating compliance of all points as submitted by the integrated regional office of the Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change at Bhubaneswar, the EAC observed that it was in contradiction of its own report submitted on 16th September 2022 in which the IRO had reported part compliance in some of the conditions. Deliberating on the proposal submitted by Atibir Industries Company Limited, the EAC warned EIA consultant Vardhan Environet for not guiding the project proponent properly with respect to submission of all the required documents at the time of appraisal of EC proposal. The committee took a serious note on non-availability of valid groundwater approval for the existing part of the project. Delhi Pollution Control Committee, DPCC, has reported a tentative annual offtake target of construction and demolition waste recycled products by the government departments to be 1.46 lakh metric tons during the financial year 2022-23. The maximum demand projected to be 4 lakh metric tons from the National Highway Authority of India, NHAI. NGT reminds Haryana government officials ignoring NGT orders amount to criminal offence under Section 26 of the NGT Act, apart from being serious deliriction of officers' duty. HSPCB has reportedly slammed environmental compensation against the Municipal Council of Palwal. Assam SEIAA in its latest meeting approves EC to all projects. Tata still set to supply about 1,200 tons of steel slag for project Arunank to build roads in Arunachal Pradesh. Vedanta joins World Economic Forum's One Trillion Tree Movement. UP Haryana tops having tire pyrolysis oil units all running in orange category of consent management. While most of the SPCVs and UTPCCs place such units in red category. Seven-day average AQI in Delhi during 3rd to 9th November slips from 402 in 2021 to 372 in 2022. To know more, please do subscribe to Enviro Annotations. It's published every Wednesday and will subscription of soft copies comes at a very nominal price of Rs. 1100 only. You can pay through UPI QR code displayed on the screen or to mobile number 9818326647. Please share your comments on this video in the comment section. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with your friends and colleagues if you haven't subscribed to this channel please do it now you can also share your stories news research synopsis your articles for publication in our print version as well as web version and share your videos for this youtube channel last but not least you can also advertise with us send us a whatsapp message to 9312491427 for more details. Thanks. We'll come back with another episode for you. Till then, do take care of your good self and your environment.